Club, everybody, and we got a box. Survival boxes, gear only, XL. And it's a normal size box. So without further ado, let's get into this. We we'll use a CRKT. There we go. And we're in. Ready, ready, ready. What do you got? Oh, god damn, it's hard getting out. Well, thank you too, sir, for sending us. And of course, we got our stringy stuff, which comes in every box. We got our thank you card and our mission card. What's the thing? Survival boxes, May of 2019. Mobile radio communication for outdoor adventures, travel, and emergency situations. And yes, because I have Glare City going on, I don't think y'all gonna see that. But so we have the Survival Box Gear Only XL, uh, $216.29 Amazon value, and $240.72 MSRP. And we only pay eighty nine ninety nine plus shipping. So that's kind of what I like about them is they always give you. We can all go look for this stuff you know, on Amazon, find it cheaper. So they give it to you. So I don't know if you all can see that. I mean, just glare, 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 glare. Whoa! Look at that. Kind of liking that a little bit. And of course, we got our survival knowledge card. Uh, Citizens Band Radio 10 codes. Yeah, so if y'all can see that, I think we got a uh, little radio thing going on, especially by the what are you seeing here? It's nice, 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 nice. I'm kind of liking this box. All right. So let's start off with the card because there's a whole lot of cool stuff in here. Already, you can already see it. It's cool. It, I'm liking this. So first off, we have the Bayo Effing Handheld 2 Radio Set. So I'm guessing this is this because Bayo Effing and half of it's in Chinese, which well, it's not America's crate, but it is survival box. So it's got some radios in it. So, and these are actually always useful, always good. Features a uh, scrambler, noise reduction, circuit, long standby time, long communication ring, high capacity ion battery, save CTS, report, number, command of English and Chinese function, humanism design. Okay, we'll see how that works out. So and that's what we got. And there's the instruction manual. This went sideways. What is all this? Oh, there's actually two in there. We got one. We got two. Oh, these are earbuds. Earbuds. Oh, okay, this is actually kind of cool. Got. Let me get this out of the way. So we got uh, lanyards for them. Two antennas. We have radio there, we have radio there, battery, battery, charging, charging. Nice. Okay, let's hope they work. But these are always actually kind of nice because, uh, you know, you get in those remote places and stuff like that where, you know, you, you don't have cell phone communication or nothing like that. You need to talk to your partner or who's with you. So, well, let me get this out of here. Nice, nice place for a battery. Put one of those in. Or try to put one of those in. How the heck does that work? Like that. 
Oh, screw the antenna on. And there we go. We got a walkie talkie. Power on. 15. Oh, yeah. We well, got the people telling us power's on. So that's kind of cool. That's, that's actually kind of fun. Because, like, when we get on to the beach and stuff like that, it's like 65 miles of nothing and you get no cell phone service or nothing like that so if you're trying to communicate with the guy in front of you then you got nothing now it sits in the charging part look lights already on so these are actually kind of cool these could be useful in a lot of different situations that's awesome i'm gonna have to play with these later this is nice 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 and then I think it comes with, I believe I've seen an earbud pocket in here. Well, let me get it out of here. It plugs into it. We got a clip. Got the cord. Got to press the talk button. And we have a little ear mount. So you can stick that in your ear. You can hear what somebody's saying. And you can push the talk off of this one and nobody else can hear what you're saying allegedly unless you're talking damn survival box stepped it up on that one that was pretty cool yeah it's Chinese but we'll see how it works so they gave that value a $29.99 value so yeah they may work but they may not who knows all right, so next up we got the Right in the Rain Survival Notebook for six fourteen. All right, I'm not a big fan of these because really, if it's raining out, I'm not writing in crap. But you know, it is what it is. Got a little grid on here, lines, and you could draw some maps or get something back to something. Uh, I'm just not a big fan of these, but if you like them, hey. That's you. But so we got one of those. So it should come in useful. Alright, so next up we got the mini pack pencils. And they're for free. Oh, that must be these. So we got golf pencils. We got a couple pencils. Same thing we eat golf scores now. So let's go with those. Really not much to be said about that. Alright, so next up you got the uh, Hey Folks Minimalist Boy. That's that guy that's been sitting up front. Kind of cool, it's got a little sheath on it or with it. Alright, so let's get into this guy, see what she's all about. I still find it ironic you need a knife to open a knife. Alright, so we have the Sierra KT. Minimalist. Oopsie. It's small. Nice little tonsil blade. It's actually pretty fairly sharp. I mean, kind of a fairly good grip on it. Nice little handle on it. Okay, I'll see that. Oh, no. Focus. Kind of a little minimalist finger, finger groove. And it has a little sheath with it. Kind of like plastic Tidex, whatever you want to call it. I think this is kind of like supposed to be a neck knife. And if you watched my last video about neck knives, uh, just, just nipple cutters or jugular stabs. But it does fit in there. And it actually fits really good. It 
and super nice looking. So that's it in its sheath. I mean, I really kind of like the way it looks. It's got a good clip on it. Really not a bad knife. And of course you got your lanyard for neck knife. But what's cool too is they also gave you the belt clip. The belt clip. So you could kind of fashion that and put it wherever you wanted to. Gear, tactical, not around your neck. So that's kind of cool. Come on, bad. And CRKT makes some pretty good stuff. Nice. I mean, finger grooves are real deep and I mean, just really good for a little knife. So that could be a good little asset for you. And then you got a little cord cordage down here and make things happen. Not bad. This is starting to be a good box. All right, so we got that. So next up is the what? C Rig 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 uh, Rig 650 Hydration Pack. So I'm guessing that's this big guy in here. It's pretty bright and plastic. I think I need another bag. I've got bags coming out of my wazoo. That's kind of cool. So let's check this guy out. We got a zipper out here. What does that do? I've oh, got a little pocket right there. Alright, so let's zip that one up. And then I'm gonna get this box out of the way now. Alright. So we got some construct compression straps right there. That open up to like a little dump pouch. Then you can just secure them back. Hmm, it's so moving on. We got this little guy. Oh, okay. This is like your soft line. It's got that felt kind of feel to it. So you can put your valuables or phone or whatever you want in there. And it's actually probably pretty accessible with this song. Let me reclip. And then, well, actually we're going to get in the big part. So yeah, you can kind of do that. So apparently though you have to unclip to get into the big apartment. Two zippers. Nice. And that's what we got. And then on the front lid we have a little compartment there. That's actually pretty deep. And it's divided with a baffle. So you got two little separate ports in there. That's kind of cool. Oh, zippers down the side. That's starting to turn out to be a pretty good bag. And at the very bottom, we got another little pouch. That one's kind of meshy. So we got another little mesh pouch on that side. Nothing there, nothing there. So that's on the front of the lid. So then we go to the back part of it. We got 
some real narrow pocket here. I'm not, I'm not sure what you use that for. But it's got like elastic on it. Like this one has. Probably a little drop pouch. And same thing up here. So, that's pretty much the interior of this thing. So we've got to find the hydration part of this thing. Where's it going? Let's look at the back side. Ah, we don't need the instructions. They've got some really nice padded straps. Ooh, look, zippers and those. What the hell do those do? This is like trying to balance a weeble wobble. And that must be where your straw goes in. And then you can cover it and it doesn't get dirty. Oh, cool, I like that idea. But then there's one down here too. What is that one? What is that? I don't know. Or maybe it's this one. I'm not sure. Just. I'm 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 confused about this one now. Supposed to be a hydration one. Not sure what's going on here. All right, so we still have another pouch right there. I think. Holy crap! Oh, there is actually hydrate. Oh my gosh! What is going on in here? So they actually do give you a hydration bladder. Oh, wasn't expecting that. Oh, it's hard to balance all this stuff. Bear with me, guys. Bear with me. I'm kind of surprised myself. So, we have a hydration bladder with the fill nozzle. And, of course, that mechanism. I'm thinking it might be pressurized. Hmm. Okay. I guess we got pressurized water bottle. And then we have our drinking hose. Which is still wrapped up and well, that's different. I've I've never seen that. And I'm not really sure where that goes. Anything else in here? Hmm. Well, that's a fun surprise. So if anybody knows how that's supposed to work, eh, let me know. And nothing else in there. Oh, and I think this is the back side of what we looked at. On the, wait, what is that? Why is the zipper backwards? There's like a backward zipper in here with a plate. Okay. So you have one other pocket in here, but the zipper's backwards. Okay. So this is kind of neat. I have to figure this out. Because never had a pressurized one. Had a camelback and all that good stuff, but... Alright. And that rounds out survival box, the gear only, XL, for 2019. Nice. We can use that. Alright, well, this is awesome. And definitely we got to play with these radios and see what's up with that. You know, we got a little CRKT over here. I'm right in the rain. We got our earbuds. All in all, I'm happy with the box. It's kind of nice. I got radios. So appreciate it. Thank you all. Appreciate y'all. Like, subscribe, and we'll do some more fun stuff like this and maybe go test some of this stuff out.
because a lot of this stuff is going to be useful real soon. Appreciate y'all.